Hey, it's Jorge from Oh so Fast Review. Today I'll be doing a quick review on Venom. I uh, just got done seeing it right now, so this will be kind of almost a reaction slash uh, review on it. There'll be no spoilers in it, so don't worry about that. Um, overall, I thought the movie was was done pretty well. Um, it definitely wasn't on par with you know any of the other Marvel movies that have come out here recently, but definitely thought that Tom Hardy was phenomenal in this movie. Um, his love interest, um, I think her name was Anne. Um, definitely, I didn't see that connection there throughout the movie. Um, her character was, I don't want to say forgettable, but she was forgettable. Um, I would say my, my main gripes with this movie really ends up being just two. Um, the villain, uh, main villain, just wasn't, wasn't done well. There was really no connection there for me. And then, um, basically, that it wasn't rated R. Um, you can definitely tell scenes where they they cut out all the blood or all, all the gore. Um, I think the movie could have been elevated so much more. Um, you know, after seeing especially uh, what Deadpool has done or what Logan has done, um, you would think that, you know, Sony would take a chance. Um, you know, but they didn't, which, you know, I guess they're, they're thinking making it PG-13, they can introduce a lot more. Um, with it, you know, tying it over to the Spider-Man verse and, and all that. But overall, though, I thought the movie was really well done. Uh, Tom Hardy's character, you know, Eddie Brock, his, uh, the way he interacted with Venom was, was done spectacular. Um, definitely, you know, I'm a huge Tom Hardy fan, so definitely thought that, that was done very well. Um, just the way they had their little, like, interactions back and forth. Um, I will say it is, um... It is getting old when trailers are showing a little bit too much into the movie. Um, there were a few scenes that definitely the trailers kind of ruin it for it. But um, overall, though, I would say definitely uh, I'll give this movie a 7 out of 10. Um, definitely something that I would buy on DVD, no issues. Um, I would still check it out in the movie theaters. Uh, there are two uh, after credit scenes, so just giving you guys a heads up on that if you do see this. Um, the first one basically sets up for a number two which would be phenomenal um the second one uh is basically a very extended um long cut of uh, spider-man uh the new spider-man movie that's coming out um i'll leave it at that but overall uh definitely enjoyed it um even with all the plot holes very enjoyable movie um just you know don't expect to to come out of it thinking you just saw avengers or like uh, Captain America Winter Soldier or anything like that just overall though this was a, a very good movie Tom Hardy killed it um, really really happy with his performance but yeah um, other than that if you like what you see uh, give it a thumbs up like this video make sure to subscribe and definitely let me know your thoughts what did you guys think about it um, did you guys like the the villain in this movie um, you know how did you think you know the whole the whole relationship kind of went um, throughout throughout the movie between Venom and and Eddie you know definitely um that internal battle uh let me know your thoughts on it but other than that uh that's it for this uh quick review uh and I'll see you guys next time